Hey, I'm Jeff. And I'm Shilia. And today we're going to talk about twin flames and eternal sex. Ooh, baby! <laughs> Does this mean you, once you get with your twin flame, it's just non-stop having sex for eternity? <laughs> no, but kind of. Uh, a little bit. But does it mean that you never stopped having sex with your twin flame? Well, let's backpedal a bit. We're going to talk about twin flames and eternal sex. So uh, you're eternally partnered with your twin flame. Yeah. And uh, what we mean here is, and what we want to talk about, is that eternally deepen deepening sexual connection that you have with your twin flame. Mm. So um, what is sex? Well, sex is an empty vessel. You can put in that vessel anything you desire, anything you choose. It can be an expression of your primal sensuality. Um, or it can be, you know, a, a pathway to all that is good or God. Or it can be uh, an expression of your loving intimacy. Mm. Or all those things or everything. So, when we talk about twin flame sex, we talk about having a partner who is best suited for you sexually someone who completely satisfies you sexually on every level. And what we really want to talk about in this video is how you can eternally build your sexual connection with your twin flame. And that's why the first time you have sex, or after you clear the ice with your twin flame, it's usually the best sex you've ever had. And in our experience, it just keeps getting better time and time and time again. Yeah. So, um, what we do to, to create that is not try to get something from sex. Oh, it was just the sexiest time we ever had. Oh, it was mind-blowing <laughs> sex. I did a bunch of yoga and Kegels and I, you know, ate my medicine bowl or whatever the <laughs> what? heck you do. <laughs> All right, I'll let that one slide. No, it's not about getting something from sex. It's about giving something to your sex life. It's about continually deepening that experience sexually. And with any other person, you're going to hit a ceiling or a floor or a wall, and you're like, well, yeah. we're, I just can't go there with them. They don't want to go that direction. You'll max out on your sexual pleasure, sexual, uh, what do you call it? Connection, journey, desire, connection. Journey, That's the yeah, word, really. Is good. You'll max out on your sexual connection with anyone else that is not your twin flame. Yep. Trust me. <laughs> I've been there. <laughs> it's like exploring this cave and you're like, wow, it must go on forever. And you're shining your light like, well, but there's a wall. But over there, I don't know. Nope. I know the whole inside of this cave now. It's a good yeah. cave, I think. Not the best example. I hope I got a good cave. <laughs> it's a little Freudian sexual. It's right, Freudian slip. It's called Freudian slip. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, um, with your twin flame, that cave is endless. There's nooks and crannies that go on eternally. There's new caves upon new caves upon new caves that you can eternally discover and explore. Yeah. And here's the other caveat. It, um, it's always right for mm -hmm. what you're looking for. Now, that's not to say that, you know, your other sexual partners were wrong. No. But, um... They were just the, a gateway. They were a pathway to your perfect to sex your life. ultimate lover. Yeah. Ultimate lover doesn't mean, ooh, smoochy smoochy, <laughs> he buys me flowers, he's such a good lover. Oh my god. It also means sex. <laughs> Great fucking sex. Yeah. Yeah. Really good stuff. And uh, good you connection. build and deepen that experience with your twin flame um, through choosing that, that love and choosing that intimacy yeah. and bringing that every time you have sex. Yeah. So when you do that, you, uh, you don't have this sort of curve where it gets, it's really hot and then it kind of dips off over time. <laughs> Which is the story for most relationships, yeah. most sex lives that are not, you know, with your twin flame. With your twin flame, it's different. It's a constant increasing. It always gets better and better and better because you have that opportunity to do that with that person. It's always increasing. Yeah, and I find, uh, I have found too, that um, there's no bodily resistance to, uh, to your twin flame when it comes to sex versus like... Uh, Mm. Like previous partners that I experienced where, you know, the the opportunity to have sex was on the table and my body was like, meh, like, well, maybe, yeah, uh. why not, I guess, like, I guess it's what we're supposed to do, right, we're in a relationship, let's do it, I don't know when we're gonna do it next, I don't, <laughs> I don't know, that's how it felt, you know, 
But that that's my body communicating to me that like uh, you're out of alignment with this person, like mm -hmm. biochemically, physically, spiritually, like you're you're not in her you're not in harmony with this person. You're like yeah. you're like vibing out. That's why you know, um like sex isn't supposed to hurt. <laughs> yeah. If so it does, good. something's out of alignment, you know. Yeah, so with your twin flame you can um not only grow together sexually but it's a, a safe container for you to heal these sexual wounds and traumas no matter yeah how heavy they may be yeah they can be healed and your twin flame is the perfect person to do that to with. be your sexual healer they're your perfect sexual healer and guess what yeah. um this is something that builds eternally whatever you build now it stays with you forever because only love is real and love never dies it never fails yeah it never goes away yeah. it's always there yeah so that's all I wanted to say about this topic. Is there anything else you'd like to share? Right? I don't know. I, I think you kind of uh, nailed it on the head. And <laughs> I think uh, I just want to add one more thing that twin, twin flame sex is perfect. It's perfect for you. It's the perfect sexual energy for you. It's the perfect loving. Your, your twin flame loves you perfectly. There is nobody... On this planet, well, I mean, yeah, you can be in harmony with everyone, but the real romantic love, uh, it's absolutely perfect with your twin flame. No one can love you perfectly romantically mm -hmm. uh, better than your twin flame. So. Because there's a certain way you desire to give love and romance. And receive it. Mm -hmm. And that's only matched perfectly with your twin flame. And somehow, like... You know, Jeff makes love to me perfectly. Like no one's ever made love to me perfectly before, and I've I've tried to be lenient. I've tried to just whatever. You know, like let's just fucking have fun. But uh, you know, like no one's loved me as perfectly like Jeff loves me sexually and otherwise. So that's the benefit of choosing your twin flame union. <laughs> sex. Have we sold you yet? No. <laughs> Twin flame. Twin flame. <laughs> Just do it. Yeah, really. Oh God, no! Don't, don't snag there. No, the more cheesy snag lines. Yeah, you can't snag Nike's line. So, anyway. Righty, yeah. Well, we'll see y'all in other videos, and thanks for, thanks for watching. If you this want one. great twin flame sex? Check out the links below to our resources that help you get into your harmonious union with your twin flame, and uh, show you how you can deepen your uh, experience with your twin flame. And if you like our work, um, there's more to be had on this channel. Please like, share, and subscribe for more videos. Nom nom noms. <laughs>